I'm Joe, and welcome back to the Joe is Hungry channel, filmed and produced right here in Fairmount, Georgia, where I review new fast food menu items and check out limited time offers. And this time, we're headed back to Freddy's in Cartersville, Georgia, to check out their new French onion steak burger. The French onion steak burger is made from two fried beef patties and melted Swiss cheese, grilled and crispy onions, bacon, and French onion sauce. Obtaining one of these a la carte will result in a net monetary loss of $8.59. If you choose a condo meal, it will further downgrade your fine finances to the tune of $11.59 before taxes in Georgia. For you calorie conscious individuals, this single hamburger weighs in at a hefty 1140 calories. At the time of posting this video, Freddy's chooses to ignore its legal requirements and does not provide any further nutritional information. Why is this? Lazy? Careless? If you have the answer, leave it in the comments below. So let's get this party started and head on over to Freddy's in Cartersville, Georgia. What can I get for you? Could I get two French onion steak burgers? That comes with bacon, grilled onions, and cheese. Is that okay? Yeah, whatever it comes with normally. So both of them just like this burgers. Both of them just a la carte. Okay, that is eighteen thirty-eight. Thank you. I've got my steak burgers. Let's pull off to the side and do the Joe is hungry temperature test. Steak burger number one comes in at 153.9 degrees Fahrenheit. French onion steak burger number two comes in at 157.6 degrees Fahrenheit. They're well within temperature limits, so I'm gonna give them a pass on the Joe is Hungry temperature test. Now it's time to determine their relative value and head back to the studio and do the Joe is Hungry weight test. French onion burger number one weighs in at 8.30 ounces. French onion steak burger number two weighs in at 8.25 ounces. Add them up, divide it out, do the math, and you come out with a very pricey $1.03 an ounce. Is this a case where you pay for what you get? We're gonna find out because it's time for the Joe is Hungry Big Reveal. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. This is what it looks like, and this is what it's supposed to look like. We've seen what it looks like. We saw how much it was. It's pretty pricey, but uh, I've been smelling this thing all the way here and while doing this video, so I am so ready to do the Joe is Hungry bite test. So it is bite test, engage. Freddy's, you hit the nail on the head this time. In a word, this burger is delicious and well worth the premium price. The edges are crispy, just the way I like them. If it wasn't for the pricing with this burger, they would push Culver's right off the map. The sauteed onions and melted Swiss cheese combine to make a deep, rich flavor. There is plenty of bacon. I can taste it. It kind of makes me wonder whether they're cooking this on site. If that's indeed the case, let me know in the comments. The bread holds up well with no bleed through after 45 minutes in my heated carrying case. The only criticism I have is the crispy onions are no longer crispy once I get them home 
home. So now it's time to give this thing a score. If y'all don't know my scale, my scale is one to 10, nine being the best. Anything above nine is a once in a lifetime experience and almost never achieved. Five and down is the slippery slope to food hell. So let's go ahead and give this thing the score that it really deserves. This thing's a 8.8 .8 all day long. Freddy's, you knocked it out of the park. I'm so happy to finally get something that tastes really good. That is my number. That is my review. And hopefully we'll see you in the next video.